promises the story of the aftermath of the Tupelo, Mississippi tornado, in which both of these two babies are lost, having been blown from their mother's arms. The tornado roared in at 9 o'clock on the night of Palm Sunday, April 5th, 1936, bearing winds of up to 318 miles an hour. It killed over 233 people and injured around 1,000, many of whom were very severely injured. It leveled 48 city blocks, about half of the town. My inspiration for writing this story came when I discovered that there was an inaccuracy in the casualty figures and that African Americans had been completely left out of those official figures. When I discovered this in 2011, I felt very angry about it. And I felt this sense that I had a responsibility to this story. This was my town. This was my story, in a sense. From the time I was a little girl growing up in Tupelo, I'd heard stories about the great tornado. I grew up in my grandparents' house, which was one of the few left standing in the tornado's path. I grew up in that house amid all the stories of how it was used as a hospital. So for me, Promise has become, as I've been writing it, as much about our present and even our future as it is about the past.